I'm going to do the same thing. I I'm a I don't know why Cleveland is so lost in the shuffle uh, this year. They they are just being dismissed. They have no pressure on them. And aside from quarterback, that team is stacked. Yeah. If they just get adequate quarterback play, uh, they're a monster this season. They're, they 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 can cause some damage. Uh, Carolina is easy to dismiss. But they were absolutely injury ridden last year, and McCaffrey's back, Baker's uh, there. Um, you can't take Carolina lightly. So uh, by no means am I sitting there saying Cleveland's an easy play on, on the first leg. Uh, but I, I firmly believe that they can stay within a touchdown, and they should, uh, as long as Brissett just plays adequately. And I'm marrying that with uh, the Vikings. I worry just a little bit about it, but. That team, I believe, will finish top three in the league in offense. I hope that they get rolling out of the gate. They're, they're going to have a little bit of defensive issues. But I see Green Bay in, in a rough spot. Rodgers never feels comfortable with young receivers, and he gets frustrated with them. Uh, you know, While they're good defensively, offensively they may not be ready to go. And I think we saw a line move down on that game, uh, if I'm not mistaken, uh, earlier today. I could be mistaken on that, but uh, so I, I just think that both of these games are going to be close. We're going through the key numbers of uh, three, six, and seven. So um, that would be my NFL free play of the day. 